Yo, what's up? We are on our way to go take on Henry Blackbury, the doctor. I've heard a lot of people having problems with this fight, so I'm going to show you a good way that I found to do it, and it's going to be using the crossbow and ice block. And effective use of ice block will reduce damage you take by a lot and protect you from one of his strongest skills, which is the blue electric ball that he fires at you. Okay, let's get into the fight. I'll show you how I use ice block. So don't hit him when he says counter. That's that's the main thing. So here's the fire it, ice block, tank it. No problem. We have to dodge that one. He's countering it. This is fine. Tank it. No problem. Let's keep DPS going down. Gotta so dodge that one. Don't hit him with the counter. Stay out of this stuff. Tank it. Just keep tanking it. It's not a big deal. If you can't tank it because you're on cooldown, just dodge it. It's no big deal. Don't get hit by these, those hurt quite a bit. Keep the pants going down. Okay, don't hit him, just wait. No problem. Tank it. Easy. Yeah, gotta dodge this one. If it does that, that's time to DPS him. Tank it. Just keep tanking it with Ice Block. It's no problem. Okay, gotta dodge that one. Tank it. Still full health. No big deal. I'm gonna get hit by this maybe. Oh, I did dodge that one. That was good. Okay, so I did actually hammer the counter. No big deal. It's gonna pick me up. Just drop. My revenge is imminent. I actually reset there. That was kind of weird. Okay, he's gonna pick me up and drop me. It's okay. It's gonna ice block. Kill it. It's fine. Oh, I hit him again. Here we go. Tank it. Keep tanking it. It's no big deal. Do you have to dodge that one? Okay, stay off this. Don't want to get hit by these. Not ideal. I'll take a time though. I did get hit by one. There we go. Let's go pick up all these. Try to keep applying damage best you can. Tank it. I can dodge that. Okay, this one, this is key. You gotta stay in the center. I'm gonna hit you once, dodge into it, recast again, and then ice block. And that's it. If you get pushed into the arena edge, you're in big trouble. Okay, you get me again, but let me go. Oh, my ultimate. Let me tank it. Now. I'm not gonna Yeah, same deal. Thank 
shit. Just keep playing with it. I'm gonna dodge that one. Okay, don't hit him. Tanked it one last time. We're just tanking it with this block. It's okay. The last one. That's it. He's done. Couple hard things. I did get hit a couple times, but pretty clean fight for the most part. Ice block is is key. Ice block is so good for blocking his main things. For the most part, it's just a mechanical fight. You gotta dodge some of the stuff. And the part where he has the stuff emanating away, you want to start in the middle because it doesn't do any damage. The, the whole point of that is to push you out into the edge of the ring and if you end up in the edge of the ring, you're going to get hit for a lot of damage and you're probably going to die. So the goal is start in the middle, let him hit you a few times, dodge into the beam because when you're using a travel skill while the beam goes out, you're unaffected by it. Let him hit you again, dodge into the beam again. At this point, you should be in the middle, and he'll just hit you a couple more times, and you won't get pushed out of the arena. Now, bear in mind also, I did use Frail Blood. I used no buffs, no anything, nothing crazy, and I did this on my first attempt for this video. I have done this without losing any HP at all, so it's definitely doable. As long as you just avoid the mechanics, then you're going to do pretty good. I really hope this video helped you out. If it did, let me know below in the comments. And if you have a better method for doing this fight, let me know below in the comments about that too. Thanks for watching. See you on a future video. Take care.